guys. What's up? We've recently been getting into bird watching. You know what I'm saying? So we have for you <laughs> two of the best binoculars money can buy. Woo! Well, our money can buy. <laughs> Alright, so these are Nikon Acolon binoculars and the good thing about these ones is they are zoom binoculars most binoculars out there are fixed zoom whereas these ones they're variable so we've got the little one and the big one difference in prices twenty dollars no nothing they're exactly the same oh, really? price yeah yeah oh, yeah wow, okay. so these ones wow. are smaller these ones are bigger and waterproof and all that stuff so first we're going to be showing you what is inside the box then we're going to be telling you which one should you get and why yeah, that kind of, yeah okay, okay so, i'm going to do the little one i'll do the big one at the same time because you know Unboxings. Da, 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 da. What do you really get in the box? Well, bada boom! You get yourself a hefty piece of package over here. You get a little one here. You get some manuals. Manuals. Too much manuals. Strap. Strap. Ah, straps. Strap. Straps. And you get yourself that yeah, another manual. Let's get to my one first up. So my one is. Okay, mine's like the size of my hand. I don't have big hands, but that's the size of my hand, which is quite nice. It's quite wow, small. Wow, wee, wow. Yours Check is this. huge. This one comes also with a tripod adapter. So you can stick this on a tripod very easily. And my one comes with like a cover for your eye lenses, which is good. Nice. So you don't smudge them. All right, these guys. Whoa, you've got a monster. <laughs> You can get some serious uh, per, per, um, <gasps> bird watching done with these. <laughs> okay, that's interesting. Yours come with separate eye lens covers, whereas mine comes with one. So interesting. They're both built similar. So this is the focus ring on mine to get that vision nice I've and crisp. I've got my focus ring here. My zoom is on the front here. And my zoom is over here. And they're both bendy, so you can get your eyepieces inside. And you can also scroll these out have a better fit if you're wearing glasses or not. Whoa, you're really close! <laughs> <laughs> so they're both pretty much the same functionality, but the difference you're going to be getting in this is the zoom. So this one comes at zooms varying between 10 to 22. However, this one has actually a better zoom capability. It goes from 8 to 24. What? And the good thing about zoom is you, you get to start off far away, and then once you find that bird you want to check out at the beach, you can just... <laughs> what? <laughs> what? So on paper, these fellas, they sound like the better deal. But in real life, if you actually try using these, they only really work at 8x. If you try zooming in to 24, mm. oh my god, the screen just gets so dark it and dim. Dark. You can't see anything. Whereas yeah. this fella, when you zoom up to 22, you can actually still see a nice picture. That's true. Yeah. And it's a lot brighter with that one. Okay, really far away, there's a now selling sign. So now we're gonna put it on the binos at 10x. I can't even read it now, I can read it. Zoom all the way. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. Oh. What about weight wise, what do you think? Mine is super light, it's just a couple of kilos. This one is much heavier, I'd say this is about oh my God, four yeah. kilos or so, maybe, I don't know, maybe. No, I don't think it's four kilos. But it's heavier, but these ones are a lot better. Yeah, but really, uh, I can't really recommend these ones. The quality just isn't there if you want to go anymore. Yeah, 8x. Yeah. Because this one, you can really go from 10 to 22, and if the quality is nice, it's bright, it's solid, it's a good use. You can even attach on your smartphone and take some pictures of the birds and set it on. Wow, it's a whale! Oh, sorry, Ash, that's just you. <laughs> So guys, I hope you enjoyed that. In summary, this one rocks. This one is good if you just want to be like doing... These ones one feel out. nice as well. They feel nice, sturdy. I feel like I'm doing something. And if you go to the camera shops, this is actually the best-selling... Um, yeah, it's crazy. Best-selling binoculars you get. Right, guys, if you found this binoculars tutorial slash review slash demonstration video useful, make sure you hit that subscribe button, like us, Leave a comment telling us which binoculars you prefer and which birds you like to, you know, use. We actually do have lots of lorikeets on our balcony as well, so that's that'd be nice to look at. That's racist. Oh, there's two. There's two. They're loitering. They're gonna have sex. Yalla, your bonnet.
Let's do it. Right it. Yeah, go on, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Make love, make love. Get your Oh, that's four. Give it to me, I'm worth. <laughs> What are you up to? Okay, so I've just, I'll make sure your eyes go funny. So I'm just looking at the Q1, which is the tallest building in Gold Coast or in Queensland. And it's quite far away from us. I'd say it's about, about three or four, 300, 300 meters away from us. And I can see it with the uh, 10 times zoom. And I've just zoomed into 22 times as well. And I can see the kitchens of the apartments in the Q1, which is awesome. Come take a look. Whoa, you can see all the way in there. Yeah, I can see the kitchens. It's cool, isn't it? There's nobody in them, but I can see the kitchen and the spotlights. Do I have a look? 